And now to a beautiful story. Sightings of humpback whales in the waters off New York have increased in recent years. But it's the sound of these majestic mammals that's exciting a lot of scientists in our area. Here's CBS 2's Bradley Blackburn. Board a ship and head just a few miles from New York City. It should be great. Oh, it's over there. <laughs> it doesn't take long to spot real life giants. It's beyond. It's beyond. It's incredible. They are humpback whales we can see and now hear, too. For the first time, scientists have proof of humpbacks singing in this area, not just in their Caribbean breeding grounds. There is a real performance going on out in the, in the water. Yeah, absolutely. Lead study author Julia Zay analyzed more than 6,000 hours of underwater recordings captured by Cornell scientists, and she couldn't believe her ears. All of a sudden, there in the background, it starts kind of quiet and then gets louder. Um, I was so excited to hear it. They sound mysterious, even eerie to us, but to whales, they may be love songs, loud and long, sometimes lasting hours. They all sing the same song within a population, and that song changes from year to year, kind of like pop songs. More of these massive humpbacks have been spotted here near New York City, but these are also busy commercial waters, and one of the biggest threats to this endangered species, ship strikes. We've had whales playing in the channel before, and some pretty close encounters with uh, some cargo ships. Scientists say studying their songs could help protect humpbacks in this part of the Atlantic. The more people get to interact with them, they become real and you, you, you care more. A siren song asking us to listen. Bradley Blackburn, CBS News, New York.